Candidly speaking, everyone, can you hold the camera on me really quick? Yes. Thank you. Doesn't need a camera person as yet. Um, <laughs> candidly speaking, we need to go this is Lisa. What's going on? So I'm going to do a little early show. I am at some friends of mine's home and or house. Friends of mine's home, plural, at home and house. You know what I mean. So I'm at my folks' house <laughs> and. Um, we're just going to um, run through a topic or two. I was going to try to do like, um, I don't know, a current event or something. Try to turn my show into like a real fucking show. And I, I looked on AJC.com and that's Atlanta Journal-Constitution for some headlines. And all of them bored the fuck out of me. Like I didn't give a fuck. I know I should care about what's going on in the world. But I don't. I don't really give a fuck. Like I don't, I don't even know what they were talking about. So the politicians, they were saying, they didn't even ring a bell. Um, so I think I'm just going to stick to talking about sex. What do you guys think? We all know about sex. Dick, pussy, nuts. In this first one, we're going to talk about nuts. What about um, girls, if you want to know, that they catch the nut, but they don't want to swallow? I'm actually going to turn this over to my guest first, the new guest, and then we'll get my opinion later. Okay, thank you. All right. So our first guest, all right there, Jay. All right. Hi. Going on? How okay. Going? All righty then. Peace up, Aizam. No, what's going on? It's your girl J Mo, partner of Seven One Eight Productions. Here in the A, doing it. 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 Doing it for them or they think it's nasty or whatever the case is but you really you know what i'm saying you're already down to that part of the business you might as well go through with the rest of it i personally myself i'm on another level i have no problem with you know how i do that's just what it is so it, it's just a but i'm sorry i'm sorry my phone's going off and i didn't mean it's, 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 you know, you, you're saying you're you're a believer in swallowing yeah okay for, for, I mean, uh, am I going to, is anything going to happen from that? No. Am I gonna what about skeeting on the face and stuff like that? Are you with that? I'm not down for okay. I'm, I'm, I'm cool That's a bit pornographic. I've okay. heard some, some myths about that's good for your skin, that's some old bullshit. Mm. I, I think that's on some old, you know, somebody who is really tripping up mm-hmm. while they were thinking about that. But I'm not personally for in the eye or, you know, on the side of the face. That's just not how I do. And I will not allow, I will cut a nigga mm, off. Understood, understood. <laughs> Okay, so he's got the call. I'm gonna go ahead and take this. And what do I think mm-hmm. about girls that catch nut and do not swallow? Yeah. Um, I mean, I think that's fine. It's different yes, people it have different preferences, and it all depends on the age of the women or woman, I should think, or even um, if she has a problem well, with nut or well, liquid secreting uh, from the body. You know, she might have a problem with that, or it could be religious reasons, mm-hmm. or it just could be uh, other reasons that I might can't even stay here because I okay. wouldn't know. But for me, with that. it just depends. Sometimes I'm in a mood to swallow. And no, uh, mood sometimes right now. They can that up. And I can my face. That. It's, it's, yo, this is what yeah, I'm you can do that. And um, it's no big deal. No big deal. That's what you're, what you're into. So, uh, and it's what, swallowing. I'm sorry. What, what's the circumstances? You know what I'm saying? Well, what what makes it. you determine whether it's a yes, you can go ahead with that, or a yeah, I'm going to swallow? Like, what in your mind makes that decision for you at that point in time? Good question. Um, how, how fucked up I may be, because sometimes if I'm too drunk or something, I don't know if I told you guys this, but it's not too long ago that I, I threw up on a penis. I threw up, um, mm. yeah, with my boyfriend's penis. And um, I was drunk. I was very drunk, and I told him I was very drunk. And for some reason, you know, that didn't seem to bother him because uh, he pushed my head down further. And I was telling him I couldn't go to the base. Right. You know, I couldn't do all that deep throwing at that time because I felt the gagging sensation that it was going to come up. Right. Exactly. And you already fucked up to begin with. I was totally fucked up. I was beyond. <laughs> I mean, uh, so, and it all came up, you know, the hot pocket. The chunky hand and teeth. He was just like, oh, and I was just like, so. So now he's kind of patient with me to make sure. He just ought to be, I'm saying. Yeah, so I, yeah I was a bit of a doozer. So, but uh, whatever he wants is pretty much what I'll do, to be honest. If he wants me to swallow, then I will. Mm-hmm. And if he feels like this, you know, on my back or on my face or on my chest, 
then that's, that's fine with me. So those are the only circumstances that I can think of. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And it feels like I'm being interviewed uh, on my show. That's great. But um, <laughs> well, you interview viewers, sometimes you gotta go viewers, with it. One of the uh, guests has stepped away. I'm actually at their home where they conduct all their business, so I'm actually on their work schedule as well. So we're just gonna go to the next topic, me and Jay. Okay. And um, if you could, let's see here. Oh, I'm not gonna say that one. Why do you think um, men eat the pussy and then put a condom on? And then you can also talk about the flip side of that. Well.